Next, pay up or park it. Puzzled by that? Well, you should be, but we do have the key to the answer up next. The subprime mortgage mess is clearly hitting people's wallets hard. Now listen to this. The Wall Street Journal reports that car loan payments are being paid later and later as well. Of course, you can still get one, but there's one big catch. At one place, or several places actually, before you can drive your dream car out of the lot, you might have to stick a gadget to your dashboard. Get this. It beeps when your loan is due. And if you don't pay up, your car won't start. I'm joined by Mike Simon, who's the chief of Securas, that's the company that makes these devices, and Cedric Brown, a finance specialist with Star Loan Acceptance Center. First of all, to you, Mike, um, let me get me this, this clear here. It sits on the dashboard, beeps when a loan payment is due, turns the car off if the loan payment becomes delinquent. Is that how it works? That's pretty close, Stuart. How it, how it works is it actually hooks to the starter of the car, and they have a green light when they're right on time on their payment. When their payment becomes due, the light turns from green to yellow and then actually starts a little countdown reminding the customer that he has so many days left. When it gets down to four days, the four button starts blinking so he knows he has four days. Then the three button starts flashing, three days. Then the two button and then the one button. <laughs> yeah. And on the last day, it's that one button and it beeps all day. So it's a real good reminder system for him. But and wait a minute, wait a minute. People, people, don't miss the, people don't miss payments because they've forgotten to make them. Surely they miss payments because they can't make them. They miss payments because sometimes they have bad behavior. And I think this has changed behavior. At least that's what we've seen for the last 10 years. Right now, we protect about $2 billion in loans, helping minimize risk for finance companies. It's, it's been a true change of behavior. Uh, for the customer and we've helped finance companies as well. All right, Cedric, what's the general reaction when you uh, talk to a customer and you say, I want one of these gadgets on your dashboard? What do they normally say? Initially, they're a little surprised um, that we have something like this now. But um, after explaining it to them, uh, just as Mike said, it's actually taken in quite well. Um, the consumer seems to enjoy it and uh, it is, it's a constant reminder it helps condition them to, um, you know, financially manage their um, selves to make their car payments. Nobody's ever said, hey, I'm insulted by this, stick it, I'm not doing it. No, because people understand if they have a certain issue um, uh, financially, they understand that this device is actually giving them an opportunity to um, purchase an automobile and, you know, make a way to um, financial stability. So the cost to the dealership which offers the auto loan in the first place, people like you, the cost to you and your organization is less than the cost of having these loans go delinquent and having to repossess the car. Oh, absolutely. Um, it's quite a benefit. Um, uh, actually, it works pretty well. Uh, I've done well with this. We've actually used this device uh, since December 2004. And it's been, um, it's worked quite well. I gotta say, when I first heard of this, I just shook my head. What will they come up with next? How many of them have you installed? E <laughs> oh, is it tens? Uh, is it hundreds? Is it a thousand or two? What is it? Oh, oh, tens of thousands. Tens of thousands, really? Yeah, we have we have a very large customer base stemming from 2004, and, and which is not really a long time, but this. This device works quite well. Mike Simon, you co-invented this. You might be onto something here. Do you think you could extend the principle and uh, go to like homeowners, for example? Uh, a beep on the front door if they don't pay the mortgage and the doors lock if they go delinquent? I don't think we're gonna go to homeowners, but we have had a, quite an interesting time of this. We've put it on printers, we've put it on MRI machines that have been sent out and if they don't pay the bill they don't get to use an MRI machine wait, so wait, wait, wait hold on I'm sorry I'm, I'm a, trying to get to grips with this I mean I can, I can I've just figured out what you're doing with cars now you say an MRI machine it beeps if they if the hospital doesn't make the payment on the MRI machine you've sold this uh, yeah we've sold it to where they send an MRI machine down to uh, Mexico and if they don't get their payment they can't use the machine so it's really changed how finance companies look at things that they finance, especially on a, on a high-risk market. So that's, that's where we've really fit this, and that's why we're do, doing so well. You're, you're extending this to all kinds companies. of equipment. Anywhere there's a payment due, you're extending this to that area. That is exactly right.
How much is one of these uh, cost? How much do they cost? Um, depending on the equipment we use, it can cost anywhere from $1,000 to $250. So it, it all depends on what the application is and how we can help the finance company and the customer. All right, Cedric, back to you for a second. How many of they, these have been installed and they actually work and stop a car from even starting when you've got a delinquent situation? Uh, every and absolutely um, every device that's installed works. Yeah, but how if many times has it actually disabled the car? Any time a customer doesn't make their payment, is in what it percentage will of the, the car. What percentage of the? Uh, can you give me a percentage when you've shut down the car? Um, maybe 10, 20 percent, if that. I think that's a little high. I don't think it's that much, um, actually, because the customers it disciplines them to make their payment. It works they like don't that. It want actually not imposes some financial car. discipline on these people. That's, that's extraordinary. Cedric Brown oh, absolutely. and Mike Simon, that, that's a real eye-opener to me. I never knew this product existed. Y y you guys really are so innovative. That mo makes America a great country. <laughs> Thank you very much indeed, gentlemen. Appreciate it. No Thank problem. you, Stuart. Thank you.